be making an electromagnet. Warning! Do not do this without your parents' supervision or permission. The materials you need are one nail or screw made of iron, a D battery, thin coated copper wire, and electric. You'll also need some items to pick up. The only things that can be picked up by magnets are iron, cobalt, and nickel. So if you're not sure, just use a magnet. This one's made out of copper, so it can't be picked up by a magnet. With your wire, you want to make sure that your ends are not coated. Leaving about eight inches, you're going to start wrapping either your nail or screw into the wire. Make sure to have the same length of wire on the other end too. Now you take your electric tape and tape it one into the positive end and one end to the negative end. Remember, the end of the wires will get really hot, so that's when you really need your parents' supervision. Now that, now that there's tape, pick up two objects. I'll take them off. Uh -huh. Is it easy to take them off? This one's too big. Oh, I got it. Alright, you're going fishing. This is how it works. Tell me how it works, Alice. By running electricity through the wire, which is what we did with the battery, the flow arranges molecules in the nail that, that causes it to attract the me other metals. What should we do for our next BKB? Comment down below. Push the yellow button. Everybody sing along. I am a big potato, big potato, big potato. Thanks for watching Britaily.